Embedding working 3D models in your FrameMaker content. Did you know that you've been able to import working 3D models in the popular U3D format into FrameMaker since 2007? Of course, back in 2007, web and mobile publishing was not as common, and U3D was not the established standard format in computer-aided design that it is today. When publishing to PDF and online formats, you not only get a working, interactive 3D file in your output, but your audience also gets access to many other features. In the model, you can change zoom and view angle. You can access views saved in the original U3D, You can play and control animations that are saved with the U3D. You can access the model tree with labels supplied by the engineer. You can choose rendering, lighting, and background color options and you can reset your view with the home button. Along with the features that the engineers made available for this model, a FrameMaker author can also create links from FrameMaker content to various features of the model. To show this, we'll switch back over to FrameMaker. I'm going to remove the U3D model and links below. Then I'll reinsert them so you can see the entire process. If you'd like to follow along, the sample files are here in your FrameMaker 2015 install directory. After deleting the existing content, I'll choose File, Import, File, grab the U3D file, and choose Import. I'm not happy with the default poster image displayed, so next I'll replace it with a custom poster, either from the graphics menu or by right-clicking on the image. Setting the graphic name will make it easier to create links to this image from other places in my document. And while it's not needed here, if this were a manual about this engine, I could link parts of the model to named destination in my document created using hypertext markers. There's also an easy way to create links to the features embedded in the U3D file itself. First, I'll position my cursor where I want the link, and then go to Graphics, Create Link to Graphic. If you want to create links to a number of locations within the model, there's an easy way to scrape the model for everything available. Position your cursor where you'd like the links in the text, and then choose Graphics, Create Link Table to Graphic. There are three types of tables you can create. Views, Parts, and Animations. Afterward, you can use the tables as is, or move hyperlinks as needed to other parts of your content. 